Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my Disneyland Paris haul from May of 2016. It is currently March of 2017, but I haven't got the time to film the video. So I did want to share everything that we got, so maybe you can see stuff that they do offer there. I watched a ton of these before we went. Um, so without further ado, I will get into it. Well, I'm going to start with the slippers. They are well loved and used and they are silly slippers. They're covered in hair um, and they're awesome. Um, they're super comfortable and warm and I love Sully so Rob kindly got these for me when we were at the park and they were $27.99 um, in euros and I don't know I just love them. He likes them too so we might be getting a second pair when we go to Disney World this year. Then we got Dumbo because he's super super cute. Um, he's got his feather in his trunk and he's flat instead of like sitting up. There's some that sit up like this, but um, he, the ones that we saw were like this um, and they were sold out of the medium size ones of the ones that sat up. And he was $25.99 in euros. And he's just so cute and they, um, the ears have a little plastic thing in here to keep them perked up. We then got Winnie the Pooh because who doesn't love Pooh Bear? He's just so, so cuddly and we didn't get him from the park, but they did have him at the park. We got him from Disney Store because they were having a sale. We were walking down Champs-Élysées on our last day in Paris and they were having 20% off the entire store so we went in and we picked up Pooh Bear because he's really cute and he was uh, $20.90 um, euros and again there was 20% off on him. First purchase that I made were these pants. They're just sweat pants. We got them right as soon as we got into the park because I was freezing cold, it was rainy and drizzly and I needed an extra layer so we got me some leggings and it's got Mickey on the leg. So these were just to keep me warm because I was freezing cold when we got in there and my jeans clearly weren't making me warm enough. So they, these were 35 euros, um, definitely worth the purchase, I wear these all the time. And then I want to get Rob something, he doesn't really buy stuff for himself so I decided that I would buy him a hoodie, he was looking at all the hoodies so we got him this Tigger hoodie and then it has Tigger on the back. It says Disneyland Paris on it and it's super cuddly and warm and I steal that from time to time and this was again 35 euros and they had a Buzz Lightyear one that Rob was like eyeing up for quite a bit but then he decided it was too like in your face Disney so he decided to get this one which is still in your face but not as much and then I got this sweater with Minnie on it and I wear this sweater every single week. Um, I love this sweater so much and it was 40, 45 euros. And uh, there was one with a bow on it that was like with a bunch of bows all over it. Um, but it was 50 euros and uh, we decided that it was a little too expensive. But this was 45 so I could have just got the other one but I do really like this one. The other one I feel is like more subtle. You can get away with it. It's like Disney but you know, it's not Minnie Mouse in your face, but yeah, we got this one and I wear it every single week. <laughs> so we also got baby clothes because eventually we will have kids and I want Disney baby clothes because they're super cute. So we got this little onesie that says Daddy's Little Nightmare and it's got a bunch of Jack Skellington's face all over it and some bats. It's just so cute. And this was $12.99 euros so like I think $17 Canadian which is like really expensive but I don't know I think it's worth it and then like I said I love Sully 
So we got this onesie. It's all fuzzy and it's it's Sully. It's super cute and it's got a hood on it with Sully's face. It's so cute. And on the back, it's got a tail. It's got a little tail on it and it's Velcro. So you can like stick it and take it off. So if like your kid wants to sleep like a normal person. So super cute. And uh, this was $29.99. So really expensive, but super cute. When we go traveling, we buy magnets and ornaments to kind of remember our trips to like celebrate it every day, I guess, and like see the magnets on the fridge. So for the magnet, we got this Disney one. I will do a close up of it so you can like see it, but it has um, Mickey, of course, Remy, Buzz. I think it's supposed to be Lightning McQueen. The E is Stitch, then The Incredibles. I don't know what the I is, so if anybody knows what the I is, leave it in a comment down below. We have Mike, Nemo, and we have Sully. So this is just a fun little magnet, and it was €3.99, so not too bad for a magnet. I, I thought that was a pretty good price. And then we got this Mickey ornament. His um, arm kind of fell off when, when we were traveling back from um, Disneyland in the night. Um, so I still have to figure out how to glue it off back on because crazy glue hasn't been working. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's really cute and it was $9.99. So, and, it, and it feels like really solid other than his arm falling off. Um, I'm sure they do like a version of this every year, but it's Sorcerer Mickey and he likes super sparkly and I just thought this one was fun. I also got pins because I'm starting to collect pins. They just make me super happy. So I got two pins on the trip. I got this one and I'll do a close up of this as well. Mickey and Minnie with like music notes. She's playing a stand up bass. And then there's a little sorcerer hat on the Zero for 2016. So I got that, and that was in the color blue. I'm Ariel is my favorite princess, so I got Ariel. She's in orange. She's super pretty. She's in her green dress, and the detailing is like crazy on it. She's got her shells, and like it's super sparkly, and I don't know. I just really love this pin. Um, I'm definitely gonna have a Little Mermaid collection. I also forgot, I got these Minnie Mouse ears. Um, I think everybody gets, well, a lot of girls get these, but they're the sparkly ones. I just like them better than the fuzzy ones, and they were a little more me. I really like sparkle and sequins, and so I just thought these were fun. Plus, they're like classic mini. The last thing I got was this photo album for all of our honeymoon pictures. It was $16.99 and I think it was worth every penny um, just to put memories and it's got a bunch of Disney characters all over it and then it's got more in the back and it has attractions and stuff that you can look forward to in the park. It holds 200 pictures so I think it's, you know, a pretty good photo album. I also think it's reasonably priced for Disney stuff. Disney stuff is always really expensive but I thought, you know, $16.99 for a photo album wasn't too bad. And that's all I got from Disneyland Paris. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe to our channel. We put content up every Monday and I'm trying to get video content up every Wednesday or Friday for an extra video, whether it be a haul or just a fun challenge video. But we're really enjoying YouTube right now. So stay with us and become part of our little YouTube family and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!